Hey everyone, Jonathan Allen here once again from Camp at RV in Stratford, Ontario. I'm here on this gorgeous fall October day to show you this fresh arrival. It's a 2017 uh, Palomino Columbus Compass Series 298RL. It's a brand new floor plan that uh, Columbus is building. They just came out with it. Uh, and with the Columbuses, they are a luxury high-end fifth wheel made by Palomino RV. This particular one has three power slide outs with a rear living room and a front bedroom. So with this one, as I mentioned, it is in the Compass series. So it's got the champagne uh, color out exterior uh, and it's a two-tone exterior. You can see it's got the power awning. The power awning has built-in LED lights and it's a metal wrapped awning. So right at the base of the awning, you can see the metal wrap that's sticking up. So when your awning closes up, uh, the uh, outside of it is uh, wrapped in metal and it keeps it nice and safe and won't let it get marked up. Uh, you know, if you're driving by uh, a low-hanging branch or something, it's not going to rip your awning because the metal wrap will protect it for you. Uh, it does have the large front storage compartment. So you can see we got our battery hookup in there. So there's dual battery boxes. And then you got two 30-pound propane tanks, one on either side. There is a light in there as well, so you can see what you're reaching for. And on the front you do have your switches for the front lights uh, and then also the power landing gear on the front uh, the dual battery box vents and then all of the Columbuses do come uh, pre-wired for a portable solar panel so it's a portable solar kit that you can get it's an aftermarket kit and it'll plug right in and then keep your batteries charged up for you so on the off door side you can see we've got the two power slide outs and then it had the one main power slide out on the door side now those switches on the front, you can see I just turned those LED lights on. So it's a fiberglass one piece cap, and then it's got the built-in LED marker lights at the top, and then the LED lights at the bottom here. So the two power slides on the off door side, and then you got a um, large power slide on the door side as well. Now this unit here, it only weighs about 10,800 pounds dry weight, so a lot of three quarter ton trucks can handle this unit. This is the basement storage which you can access from both sides. As you can see it goes right through from one side to the other. And I'll show you it from the other side because it does have some hookups over there for TV and stereo and uh, also your uh, central vac for the inside. Now over here it does have the convenience center. So yeah, as you can see this is all closed in in one piece box. There's no seams here. So it's got the outside shower. It's got your uh, gray and black water uh, valve for draining. Uh, also full system water purifier. Uh, the bypass for the water heater and also all your bypass for winterizing and your your uh, sorry your water hookups and winterizing hookup is there as well as a black tank flusher so all the hookups are right in this area so very easy to access uh, so when you're winterizing on your own very easy to do and then as you can see it's got the plug at the bottom so all the cords and the connections come up the bottom and that thing just closes right up and it's got the slam latch baggage doors so they just slam shut. The water heater is a 10 gallon and it's gas and electric. At the back here you'll see the power hookup. It's a 50 amp connection. Marine style detachable cord. Uh, and it does come with the 50 amp cord. And then you got the power rear stabilizer jack. So just touch of a button they go up and down. Uh, also on the back you got the LED tail lights. There's a roof ladder. Nice big window at the back. It's a rear living room, so you'll see that from the inside. Now this one also has an outside kitchen on it. So that just opens right up. And then so it's got the microwave, it's got the fridge. It's got some lights in here as well. Brightens everything up for you. And then there's a pull-out stove top two burner so you can do all your cooking outside and you don't actually have to stink up the inside of the trailer if you don't want to although if you're cooking bacon it's never a bad idea to have the inside of the trailer smell that way and then it's a slam latch baggage door on this door as well so it just slams shut and then it's got the extra latches on the side now the storage compartment I'll show you from this side so they use the magnetic holders for the doors, so you got magnets on each side and then same thing up above. So you just push the door up and the magnet will grab it and hold it open for you. 
So you can see the storage from this side. Again, nice big open storage. And then over here you have an outside stereo separate from inside. So that's attached to your outdoor speakers, which are up top. And then also the central vac hookup is here. Uh, battery disconnect and also cable and satellite ho hookups for an outdoor TV. And then slam latch doors, so they just slam shut. Now it does have the keyless entry on this one, and you'll notice no set of stairs. So this has got a really cool feature, they've got the new Moride steps. So when you open this up, you'll see the stairs locked into the door frame. And then all you do, you twist it here, it unlocks, and then it just folds right down. They're aluminum, so they're nice and light. And then it gives you your set of stairs, and they're nice and sturdy, a lot, actually, a lot better than the normal set of stairs that you would get on a trailer. So the first thing you'll notice in the interior, it's a nice big open living space. And again, it does have the opposing slides, so it gives you lots of floor space. Right across the back is the tri-fold sofa. The sofa will pull out to an extra bed. And you got the nice big window on the back and on each side, and there's overhead cabinets above. It does have the theater seating with the built-in cup holders and storage. Overhead cabinets up above them as well. Across from your theater seating is your TV entertainment area. So you do have the high definition wall mounted flat screen TV. It's got the sound bar up above. And then you got DVD player down below. It is a Blu-ray disc player. And then the electric fireplace down below it. And you can see you got storage beside, up above and below. Facing forward here you can see the nice big long countertop. And then it does come with the two bar stools. Lots of counter space. You do have the high rise faucet with pull down. And then also the matching sink covers. So you got solid surface countertops along with the matching sink covers. So when you're not using the sink, it gives you lots of prep space. You can see all the storage down in the island here. And then it does have the four door fridge. It's an 18 cubic foot four door and it's propane and electric. So there's a ton of storage in it. So lots of room in that fridge and freezer. Any extended stays, it's nice to have this big fridge. This big fridge is optional, so you don't have to get it. You can get it with the new normal two-door fridge if you like. And it does have the oven, the three burner stove with the flush mount glass stove cover. You also got the microwave up above and cabinets above that. And you can see lots of storage over here, so this would be your pantry. Lots of extra storage there, and you got more storage cabinets above and beside them as well. Does have the living room ceiling fan, and all the interior lights are LED, so they're nice and bright, and they use very little power. We ordered this one with the kitchen fan, uh, Max Air fan with the rain cover. So with that, it comes with a remote control. The remote control just gets mounted right in this holder here. You just hit a button, it can open up, and you can turn it on and off. See the nice decorative uh, lighting above the kitchen area there. The dinette is a table and chairs, so it comes with the two residential style chairs and then two extra fold up chairs which they store up in the front closet. But there is storage inside these chairs. And there is an extension on that table as well that slides out. Just a leaf that comes out and locks into place, gives you more room. All the windows are equipped with the day night shades, so the day shades that are see through and then the night shades pull down over top for privacy. As I mentioned it is equipped with the central vac and the central vac you've got the connections for it but you've also got, just got the sweeper. So when you have it like that you can just sweep everything right into it and it'll suck up all the debris for you. You'll notice it's got the wood covered stairs so the stair treads are wood instead of carpet high traffic area won't wear them down coat closet when you walk in bathrooms all fully enclosed it's got the porcelain foot flush toilet and then you got the nice big shower it's a two-piece abs shower with the frosted glass sliding door and it does have the skylight above and then beside the toilet there, you do have an extra storage cabinet. And then there's a roof vent above the toilet with a built-in 12-volt fan. And then the vanity. The vanity has storage below and medicine cabinet above. 
And then the bedroom at the front. So you got the full size queen walk around bed. It is a Serta Destination Series mattress. So nice, very comfortable mattress. Nice big pillow top on it. Uh, same style mattress that you'd buy for your house. Uh, that's what they're putting in the trailers now. So very good quality. Uh, large wardrobe across the front. So you got the sliding doors. You can see nice big open closet storage. And then you got the extra door over here which has your washer dryer hookup. There's the two extra chairs. Lots of extra storage in there. In the box there is the uh, connections for the central back as well. You can see on the bed there you got a reading light on each side as well and a window on each side. Roof vent in the bedroom which you can get those with optional built-in fans as well. Nice and bright in the bedroom. Lots of windows. Lots of storage. Got the TV hookup up above the dresser there and it does have the backer in the wall where you can mount the TV. And then you got the solid pocket door with the mirrored front on it. You'll notice the flooring. We ordered this one in a wood grain floor. It is available in a tile floor as well. Uh, Columbus gives you quite a few options for colors. So the, the flooring, uh, the cabinetry color, the exterior color, and the interior uh, uh, color in terms of your furniture and your valances and everything. There are quite a few options for them. So again, this is the 2017 Columbus Compass 298RL. Again, it's a brand new floor plan. Uh, we're the first one in Canada to have it in stock. You can check it out on our website, campoutrv.com. We do have quite a few uh, Columbus and Columbus Compass units in stock. You can uh, see all of our available inventory, like I, like I mentioned, on our website, campoutrv.com, or stop in and see us, and we'd be more than happy to show you through our inventory. You can see, looking down the line here, we have quite a few Columbuses in stock and Compasses. Stop in and see us anytime. Thanks again for watching our video. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye.